Radio, also AMFM, 247.com. Tune in, iTunes, and of course, Radio Loyalty today. And uh, we have got a fantastic guest joining us today here on Skype Video. Scarlett Riviera is with us. And uh, she is a fantastic, fantastic musical artist. Talk to me a little bit about how you got started doing the music thing. Well, you know, I started in grade school. Wow. Uh, yeah, our, uh, our our school system, you know, actually sponsored, uh, you know, real music. Uh, kids, you know, had the opportunity to be in orchestra or band. So that I started with private lessons in orchestra. And uh, that went through all the way from grade school all the way to high school and then into rebellion. Wow. <laughs> and rock and roll. <laughs> So uh, you have accomplished a heck of a lot in your time as as a musician. Uh, you've got a brand new EP out there, All of Me. Tell me a little bit about this. All of Me is uh, my vocal debut. After all of the years of, of uh, putting out albums and being uh, in other bands and on other recordings, many solo recordings, none of them were vocals. They were all instrumental. Wow. And uh, so I finally made the big splash, the big leap uh, to be singer-songwriter and step up front to the vocals. <laughs> Fantastic. We have got a great guest with us today. She joins us here on Skype. Scarlett Riviera is with us. She has got a brand new EP. It's called All of Me. And uh, the EP consists of six original songs written by Scarlett and debuts her as a lead vocalist on the tracks. A couple of the songs have a uh, political bent to them. Lady Liberty exclaims her concerns for the state of the country's democracy and her song 50-50 is uh, just an amazing, amazing uh, equality for women. A uh, great, great tune. So uh, tell me a little bit about the writing process, production process, putting these six songs together and getting them out there. Um, the writing process all started with uh, my uh, friendship and real partnership with uh, Tim Goodman, our pro my producer, but also co-writer. And he um, and I started, you know, really with not the intention of it being a full album or a full EP. We just started with the intention of writing and see where it went. And uh, little by little, it actually uh, evolved into being the real thing, and he was there every step of the way, uh, helping, um, you know, select the fantastic roster of musicians on it, um, Tremendous. setting up the recording sessions, and recording actually bi-coastally. So some of these songs were uh, recorded in uh, b outside of Boston, Martha's Vineyard, and the others were recorded here in uh, Los Angeles. Fantastic. Well, you have a uh, you have a video up on uh, YouTube for Lady Liberty. Let let let's talk a little bit about this. Take me through this video. Uh, it is it is a uh, pretty cool piece of business here. Tell me about this music video for Lady Liberty. Uh, well, it was uh, something I wrote a month after the election, so called election, and um, I wanted you know, some visuals to go with it. And I eventually uh, met a wonderful guy named uh, Jose Stefani Marquez, and he, Marquez Stefani, and he uh, helped put it together, uh, edited it, and then we selected all of the images and uh, that were pretty hard hitting images, I must say. You, you've got a uh, great song here. We're uh, popping this up for uh, television viewers and social media viewers right now. It is Lady Liberty Scarlet Riviera with us today here in a broadcast. And uh, you, you shot this in, uh, in, in Hollywood, California. Talk to me a little bit about uh, some of the different images, some of the different things that you chose uh, to put in this video and, and how this whole thing comes together for you. Um. Well, I, I just wanted to show um, uh, how things could be and how uh, they are. You know, some of the, you know, consequences of, of losing our democracy that date back to even the times of, of Hitler, uh, Stalin. There are in there um, images of the Ku Klux Klan, um, some pretty hard stuff. And um, that uh, skinheads, those images are real. 
uh, images of, you know, the border, um, you know, being something that's impassable. Um, and then at the end, didn't want to keep hammering on how difficult, you know, this all is. So we wanted to look back and, and, and actually reverse the process. So we went into people walking backwards and backwards into what we really want our democracy and our country to look like. Fantastic. We have got a uh, great guest with us today. Scarlett Riviera joins us. Lady Liberty is the latest from her, and we're uh, playing a little bit of the video here on uh, on our program here for television viewers. It is a uh, powerful, powerful video. Um, talk to me a little bit about some of the feedback you've gotten on this video and some of your music and things of that nature. Um. Um, I've been getting great feedback on uh, uh, the album, uh, the song Dust Bowl. Yes. Uh, Dust Bowl we, was chosen as the single, and um, th that was really inspired very much by the, uh, Woody Guth Guthrie and going to the Guthrie Center in Oklahoma, uh, really being reminded historically of, you know, what what can happen when, you know, humanity is out, out of step with nature. And um, when we damage nature, it damages us back and it hits us hard. Um, so that, that was a 10-year thing of, uh, you know, called the Dust Bowl that, you know, blew away people and their lives and, you know, ended up being like the book of, you know, the Grapes of Wrath. Yes. That whole thing. Yes. You know. Yeah. Yes. Uh, so, um, with this EP, uh, w w when do you start writing and, and producing and, and getting the next, uh, the next thing ready to go here as far as music now that the EP's done? Um, I always continue writing, um, and, um, I hope when all of this is over, uh, that, me I mean, quarantine, that we're able to, as musicians, get back out in the world and, uh, perform live. That's fantastic. That is fantastic. Well, Scarlett, it's been an honor and a privilege. I really appreciate you making time for us today. Thanks for coming on our program and chatting with us. And uh, have yourself a blessed, blessed day, my friend. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. There she goes, Scarlett Riviera.